Hey guys, my name is Sidiac and welcome back to another episode of Software Inc. Where guys, last episode, we officially moved our mum from our mum's basement, should I say. And uh, we've moved to the desert, which we've now built a beautiful new office, which looks freaking glorious. Uh, we've got a little room over here and over here for two little offices, which we're going to set up a proper core and design team. Which hopefully is going to go really, really well. We'll see exactly what happens. Uh, got a nice little kitchen at the back there. Uh, let me bring down the wall so we can kind of see it again. There we go. Uh, we got a little bathroom set up. And somebody said that, Cineac, you should get rid of these windows here. Put doors down and create like a nice little open garden space. Which I thought was a freaking amazing idea. But before that, we do that, guys. We um, I'm going to fire everybody. I know I said I was thinking about it. Some of you said don't do it and all that. I'm going to fire them all. And we're going to start literally from scratch. And the only reason I thought about... Well, the only reason I thought about well, the, the, you know, the reality behind it by keeping them was... They're already, some of them are already you know, kind of decently educated. We're going to start all again. Now, I don't mind that. What I can do by firing them is make sure that the, the compatibility for the whole teams is amazing. So we have like no issues. Everyone's going to be loving it. And we can really keep up that efficiency. So if I get to manage my employees, I don't know if I had any employee benefits, which I don't. So I can literally, you know, get rid of them all and it shouldn't affect us too much. So if I fire them all, dismiss them, they are gone. If I press play, fast forward. Yeah, it didn't cost us anything. Okay, sweet, 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 sweet. We keep my two million and uh, we're going to set up the two teams and we're going to do this all correctly. And so we've got the code team, which is only your boy in there right now, uh, which we'll, we'll hire those guys first. So hire employees. I can only get four in because that's all I've got set up at the moment until we do some more expansions and whatnot. Let's get rid of all this. There we go. Sweet. So I've only got it set up to where there's four in office. I will expand it as time goes on. Uh, but we want programmers, and we're going to go with system first. We'll go high, overall skill, personality, up it all. Begin looking. So compatibility, we want amazing. So I'm just going to keep looking again until we find amazing, which we do. And we're going to go for Rosemary here. Now, she's got amazing compatibility. She's got skill four. Which, uh, no, three, sorry, at four there. Does it go up to five? No, it's up to four. And we're going to hire you. Bam! I can hire uh, Irene too. But I don't know if I kind of keep it all on system or... I mean, I could eventually... Do you know what I could do? Is eventually... i look again as well. I could train him to do other stuff. So let's get Derek over here. Let's hire him. So that is for amazing compatibility for uh, our coding team. So let's set up a new team. And we'll just simply call it our design. If I can spell design right. There we go. We'll, well, we'll only go for designers in this. That's all we'll do. Because the compatibility is 171%. Damn. Uh, we eventually have our dedicated artist team as well. Market team, support team, all that kind of stuff. So we'll go with design and we'll go we'll go system because we can eventually train him to do everything else. Uh, begin looking. So amazing compatibility with um, click on Weldon here, but I don't know how it's going to change with design. But we'll hire Weldon to be the focal point. Oh, and these people over here. Okay, two, three, four. So what's the compatibility like on that team? Hundreds, it's Oh, it's a percentage more. That's interesting. That's very interesting. So we did set up uh, this one over here to be with the kind of um, fingers, jigs, what they called, the drawing tablets. So we're going to designate this room then. Uh, oh, hold on. Wrong button. Limit room usage to... Wait, how do I set it up for that room again? I completely forgot. Switch team. There we go. For our design team. And this is switch team for our coding team. There we go. Nice. So we're going to also hire as well because we got a little bit of that cash money moving out in the bank right now, boys. Uh, we're going to hire a receptionist. We're going to hire a cook so they can cook our team up some delicious food. We'll hire maintenance. We'll hire IT. We'll hire a cleaner. And we'll hire a security because we recently found out that, you know, 
we got burgled, so that wasn't good. And we'll make them come in. Actually, they can stay all like that. That's completely fine. We'll leave it like that. And while it's on our mind then, I'm going to quickly get rid of these two windows right now. Demolish, yes. I'm going to replace it with a double glass door. And if I spin around, let's get the, the fence set up. So how do I do rectangular fence? Okay, so if I come out by five, what do you mean? Can I not freeform the front the fence? Is this how I do it? Aha, I think it is, yeah. Okay. Oh, hold up. Can I Has has it all gotta join up? I don't get it. So that line there is six, so it would be eleven. And that would be five. Press control to... Okay, control. Oh, sweet. Okay, that's nice. So we've got a nice big garden then. Furnishings. Is there a, like an outdoor room? Outdoors? Yeah. And we'll place down a couple of benches right now. So they could use these benches maybe to like, you know, to eat their food on. Which would be pretty cool. Should we get a little pine tree or is that going to make really much sense? I don't know. Uh, let's get a small little tree out here. Let's get a couple of small trees. There we go. Weird trees as they are. But. Yeah. We got some trees, boys. We got some trees. And that's kind of all we need to do then. So we can actually now bring them all back into work. And things can start rocking and rolling. Okay. One thing I don't think I have is lights. So let's just kind of see how that plays out in general. Uh, okay, so while things are happening, the market, marketing folio, that was our um, operating system. Do we have enough? Let me check out all, not all companies, all software, our releases. Yeah, we have quite a bit in stock. And the great thing is they can now arrive by car, so we haven't got to wait on the bus. So let's fast forward then until somebody arrives. We might have to wait till the following month, to be honest with you. Which is the next day, which... Pause a second. Where's my designers? I don't know. But hold on. We made, in terms of sales, almost the same amount of money. It's just the more money went out because we did hiring. Um, what else did we do? Con oh, construction. That was a well, we spent a lot of money on construction building the office because this is the first month where those money the money comes out. Now, we do need do we need lighting in here? I think where's our team anyway? Oh, the, that team starts a little bit later. I forgot. There we go. I completely forgot about that. So they're marketing the, the folio there. We're getting some research done as well. And we could potentially start our next um, finger magic. So the employees arrived, but why are they not going into that room? Oh wait, they're different employees, aren't they? That's just like our um, what you call it? Our cleaner, our IT dude, and whatnot. So let me pause for a second because we now have a deal coming in. Oh, I think they're just arriving, maybe because we have a receptionist. I can do a print job, but I don't really have anything to do with that really do i no um okay normal play mode then so should we get something else set up right now we're still doing the marketing over there which is going to make us quite a bit of money for quite some time to come just yet researching that system thing there to see if we can get any royalties off it and uh we, we need to then eventually create our own dedicated support team but let me get rid of all the walls so we can see what's going down there's food on the table there so the employees can grab a little bite to eat. So let's create a new software then. And let's go with a... So what have we made so far, our releases? We've made a antivirus, an office software, an operating system. Let's make a 2D editor. Right. And let's have everything that will require it to be a one-star 2D editor. There we go. And that's going to take approximately two years to create. 
based on eight programmers and six designers. Ooh. Now, expect me just 100%, which is good. So what can I bring it down to where... Okay. So approximately two years to create. Take those three off there. Still 100% expected interest, which is great for us. Uh, so development team code, design team, designers. Well, you've got two teams in there, but let's get rid of the coders there. So they're working on that. Publisher, we don't really have one. And right, so let's give it a name then. So it's a 2D editor, which is pretty much like a, um, a graphic editor, like, like Photoshop, but it's only 2D base. So we've got to call it, I mean, I could, I could, I could literally call it Photoshop and we take that name. I mean, I feel like it's it's the year 1986, so I'm going to steal the Photoshop name. So call it Photoshop. And we call it Photoshop. Yeah, just, just call it straight Photoshop. No gimmicks, no messing about. And we'll go 99 on the price. Right. We've got 100% expected interest, so we could do pretty good with this. Uh, okay, let's go to the advanced side of it then. So new framework, we'll call it um, 2D. There we go. So when we create the next one, we've got something already, you know, in place for it. Uh, ain't got to do any of that. Right, next. So operating systems. Let's go for every operating system available. There we go. So it take four years to create this time, but at least I've got a higher, you know, consumer reach, which is sweet. That'll be nice. Keep that the same there. I don't want to go too crazy. And... I think we're good to go. Right, start developing that then. I know it's going to take quite some time because I've only got four coders, but we'll eventually hire more as time goes on. And we have the free time to do multiple you know, iterations and stuff like that. There's nothing really going to be slowing us down. So we'll wait for the following month then as we make even more cash money moolah. The designers are now officially in as well. So they'll start working. Uh... Um, guys, we have freaking kangaroos right now. Are they going to start jumping on the vehicles, the cars, and stuff like that? Is this normal to have freaking kangaroos? Oh, I don't know. I don't even know anymore. What is real? What is real? We have freak. They're literally going across the car park. They're going to jump on the cars. Um, guys, I don't want to alarm you, but there's kangaroos going past your vehicles right now. Where did those come from? I have no idea. Uh, but in terms of money, we made 1.9 million sales. So we didn't make as much in terms of sales. Uh, it feels so high because I don't really have the construction cross, uh, costs. So that's kind of, yeah, it makes sense there. Um, right. I was going to check something. Oh, yeah. Uh, how many net units we got left in stock? 44,000. We're still okay. Right. So these iterations, we can actually get them done pretty quick because the way it's kind of going up right now, I'm going to get a couple of variations down and then just uh, keep it going. I might hire some more employees as we add more to the team. But this is... Okay, so three have now gone on vacation. It's also raining in the desert. Didn't know it rained in the desert, boys. But we got to think about building some more people. Now, I can get two more offices, computers here which will actually work wonders for us. So if I move that to this side, move that to this side, and do the same in these ones. Let's skip to the next day. I'm literally just getting iterations done. So we keep the plants in there. We're just now going to be, um, you know, getting in two more offices. So we're on the second iteration right now, which they'll keep rocking and rolling. We're still making money. We've got seven million in the bank. Wow. That's crazy. That is a lot of money, isn't it? All right, next month anyway. So we don't meet the demand for the sales or the folio. Yeah, we've only got 4,000 left in stock. How much? We've made $6 million profit off that at the moment. Right, let me uh, order copies. I'm going to order 100,000. It might seem a little bit crazy. But I feel like it, that's what is going to be needed. We've made profit off all the software we've created so far, which is good. Um, right, let's fast forward. I want to see them get to the, the third iteration. And uh, how that's going to look. Going for our 2D team. So, someone is... Um, an employee is having trouble finding a place to sit and eat. 
Can they not go outside and sit and eat? I did. I did put doors down, didn't I? Yeah. So why is it they can't go outside to sit and eat? Right, let me uh, sell that. Maybe it's not the right type. So function, table. We can... I'm sure there's one where we can create ourselves, isn't it? So like that type there. So, right, let's go to table, sorry. And, um... Right, I'm, I'm gonna... I just want to check something. I'm going to humor myself for this for a moment. Yeah, let's just go for normal... Normal tables and chairs. Right, that should be more than enough. For the, that's like... That's four, two, four, six, eight. That's ten. Ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, do you reckon they can't go outside because of the... Uh, that might be in the way. If I just drop that like that, and then revert back to put in some of these out here. But I put one there and just see what happens. All right, can they go outside now? Let's put these walls down. We now got to wait until they, you know, get something to eat. But we're in the third uh, iteration anyway. So let me, uh, okay, let's just slow down for a second. Let's get the uh, the new office kind of stuff in. So all I gotta literally do is copy that and duplicate it. Where's the duplicate button? Oh, there it is. I should have... Oh, I didn't slip the tables. Right, duplicate. So... One, two. And then all I need is, in terms of funk... No, room... Office. Where's office? Those little things there. Just like that. That's kind of all I need. So I could I could place one there and there just to kind of fill up the hole, which is good. And then let's just replicate this on this side. I'm copying these ones because it has... Duplicate the uh, think. Oh no! No, oh, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. It was this. You know the the, the tablet. Oh, not duplicate. Sorry. Replace furniture with the tablet. Join tablet. That's it. There and let me duplicate these. Oh no! I got the wrong one selected. Duplicate them real quick. Spin that. Okay, that should be okay. So we can get an additional two employees per team right now. That would be a big help. Oh, we've seen people walk around that path there. I think we are, aren't we? Yeah. Um, okay, right. That's all done then. Let's skip to the next day. And let's hire some new employees then. So I'll take it. I'll do a little bit of a different stance right now. We'll select 2D, high. Begin looking for the design team. Compatibility amazing. Hire you. Look again. And hire you. There we go. So then hire employees. And we'll go programmers. And we'll go with. Hmm. Let's go. Let's go audio. I don't know why. I'm just, I'm just feeling slightly audio y. And begin looking. And it's for our core team. So already amazing compatibility, amazing there. Two additional peeps there. So get them in them. Now I wonder how that changes our team. Like um, percentages. So, oh it's made the, um, oh hold on pause. It's made the code team go up to 172, unless that was the 172 one the whole time, I can't remember. But apparently the folio has now run out of, what did that say, sorry? I can't keep up with the support of Folio. Now with the extra team members, it might be able to help out. We have to wait till next month for them to come in. But iteration right now, we're on number three. Number four will start very soon. So can't keep up with the support, but those team members are now here. Um, is anybody able to go? Yeah, they're able to go outside. 
Okay, hold on. Looking for a visit, uh, a visitor looking to strike a deal. Your company went home due to condition of your waiting room. Drinking is because they can't sit down. Right, we'll, we'll squeeze another sofa. Let's see if I rotate it like that. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> <laughs> right, fast forward then. At least they can sit down, right? He's walking back and forth. He's like, this is not the waiting room, dude. This is the waiting room. Take a seat, fool. Okay, let's skip to the next day then. So two peeps are called in sick. They now go outside and eat, which is good. I think that, that table and chairs must have been blocking the exit. Right, what deals have we got? Print job, marketing, design. I don't know if it was the best time to hire um, a receptionist. So, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going dis to dis dismiss the receptionist. Cleaning and security can stay. I'll just hire the IT and support uh, maintenance guy when I when and when I need them. That makes sense. Right, in they come in. Are we doing iteration four? Should we try and get it to the fifth one and then start work? Or do you reckon like, I'm really am pushing it? Oh, that's, that is my security dude. I just realized. Right, if that's my security dude, then let me sort out that path, because that's going to freaking annoy me. Um... Oh, that's going to really annoy me. Ooh. I needed the uh, a square one, don't I? Yeah. There we go. So I believe he's just wa walking back and forth between there. He's not walking on dirt, if that makes sense. Right, I don't feel like we're going to get to that next iteration. Four is where they're pushing it. So let's now develop it. Uh, first job is reach alpha, but there's still doesn't have any followers. Yeah, we get that. We got that. I got 10 million in the bank right now. Holy moly, are we getting money coming in? It's beautiful. All right, let's wait till they all start arriving then. So they still can't keep up the support of Folio. It is what it is, I'm, I'm afraid. And uh, now beginning work over here. So at some point, I will get rid of everything that's related to Folio. So why can't... Oh, I haven't got assigned the design team. There we go. So they can also now start working as well. Skip to next. And we should really set it up where the design team and code team are doing certain jobs. So manage teams. We have to manage tasks. Okay, no, no, they're doing all that. That's all good. How do I do it where manage roles? So the code team don't do any artist or design. What service? Is that like support? Not sure. And then design team. Impl oh no, wrong one. <laughs> no. Oh, now they want pay rises. Manage roles. No programming, but we can do a bit of service support. So I can assign the design team over there and there. Get fixed them a little bit quicker. Now, if I go to manage employees, yeah, the ah, uh, yeah, it is support then that kind of stuff. Uh, they've got their assigned tasks to what they can and can't do, so they'll only focus on their you know preferred job at hand, which would be a benefit for us to try to get stuff done. Should we assign the uh, designers on that as well? So hopefully we can maybe get that researched. All right, I'll accept all the pay rises because I feel I'm feeling generous. So marketing gets done. We, we make a, a little bit of a dent into the support. They're all outside eating. Now we got... Oh, the kangaroo's gone past. Now we got that larger table at the, at the front. I can maybe even like get some HR done where one of them's a leader. And stuff happens. That could also be a good thing to do. Right, skip to next end. So we, we're pretty much just on the halfway from Photoshop being done right now. Uh, got 11.5 million in the bank. That's great. 
Cleaner goes around and clean, which is also great. Uh, do you feel like it's a little bit dark in this building? Might need to get some lights set back up. So we're now officially halfway. Well, slightly over halfway if you combine both of them. And our employees are doing an amazing job. Six employees to a team. So that's 12 employees in total in terms of, like, workers. Obviously, if you don't count the, uh, the, cook, the chef, the security guard, and the cleaner, that's 15 in total if you count them. Which is still a lot, isn't it? Still really is. Right, seven employees on a vacation, so not much is going to get done this time around. But we're still pushing it anyway. Still pushing it. And every month that passes, we get a little bit more research and done. We started doing it in 1985. It's now 1987. I don't even know what we're researching. System something or other. <laughs> I don't know. We need to sort of, They seem to walk across this as well. Not much we can do about that. But the cleaner comes in and cleans. What are these rooms like? And they, you know, 200% environment, 200%. That's 48%. So, is there anything I can do with this? Furnishings. Where's the lights? Is it come in the building? Function. Lighting. Let me put the walls up. That's not the wall button. What am I doing? But here is the lights. Alright, let's just go for that. I mean, it won't change the environment, because we've got to get stuff up, and it does have a like, re really big air conditioning unit in it. <laughs> that doesn't help out. But I would have thought the lights would have stayed on. Right, manage team. So let's make them stay two hours longer in the day. It's going to tire them and wear them out, and they're going to hate me for it, but I might be able to get in a couple of months with no complaints first, before things get a little bit, you know, before they get a little bit windy. Windy? Whiny. <laughs> Windy, Sadiac! You for real right now? And there we go, bring them all in. So things seem to be, you know, rocking and rolling pretty well. The researching's getting done pretty well too. Support's being handled wonderfully. There's nothing left queued right now. Uh, how much you make money we're making? Making 170 odd thousand uh, last month. So the sales have gone dramatically down, which is understandable. Because, you know, we've reached our, you know, customer base, but... Oh, we lost money. What happened? Our sales dropped dramatically. Now, it's not because we haven't got enough copies, is it? No, we've got plenty of copies, 27,000 in stock. I think we've plateaued and we've kind of now in the down spiral of our employees. Also, our computer's not too good. So let's call maintenance and call IT support just to get those guys in and rocking and rolling. They can fix a load of issues that we have. Right, and we're getting close right now. We're going to get the research in for the uh, the patent done before the Photoshop's done. Which is quite interesting. Right, 80% of the code, 78% of the art. And, oh, one of our employees can now be edgy. Oh, two of them can. So... Let's uh let's educate. And there we go. And then Derek, we can educate you. And we'll go with the 2D there. And they'll be off now for the, a month. While they and while they get educated and they'll come back better than ever. So how much money are we losing? 120,000. Okay, so we we've got enough money to see it through until Photoshop's done. This 2D editor. We did we did quite a few iterations as well, so hopefully it kind of you know works out what you know works wonders for us in the long run. Employee is tired, which is not great, so they're not going to have. I feel I, like I really have now pushed it. Oh, are oh, you joking me? A, comp a competitor has publicly released their system tech research. My re all that research we did there for nothing. Ah. <sighs> Okay, at least they can focus on this now 100%. Let me up the priority on that as well. 
Well, we still making. We made two thousand six hundred profit off the market for um, market folio, our folio operating system. So we're still keeping it going for the time being, anyway. All right, ninety three percent. We're up the code to right now. We made three. Okay, we're gonna end all of. Uh, let's cancel support. Yeah, let's cancel the end of marketing. Yeah, all gone. So now all of our focus is now on Photoshop. And we're getting there. We're definitely getting there. Look at that, code 98%. And it's all down to the artwork. All right, some employees can now be educated as well. So let's educate you. Get your... Let's get your 2D up as well. So I'll just keep doing a little bit of everything. 2D, 2D, and slowly keep them going. So all that's left to do now then is the art. So let's now start sorting this stuff out. Let me get to the next day, next month. Let's let's promote. No 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 no. Mark it with a release date. You know I don't mind it's coming out in four years. We'll also mark it with a press build. And we'll mark it with a press release as well. Get both teams working on that. Right, 99%. We need that 100% mark. And this will be the perfect 2D editor. Right. It should happen this month then. So we, we're starting to build a little bit of hype up for it now, which is great. Come on, that art can get to one more percent. You can do it in a month, right? Come on. You can do it this month. You can do it this month, guys. Don't play games with me like this. 99%. Are they not going to get it to 100% this month? Are you for real, guys? You couldn't get 1% in a whole month? There we go. Promote. So it's now in beta then. We'll give them a couple of months to fix things. Oh, I think it's because I've sent a lot of employees like away for education, haven't I? Uh, yeah, I could have what's be oh we're making money What started making money pause I've just realized we're now making profit Um, our right, releases Past month folio started since I stopped Freaking marketing it. It's gone up again That's really weird that's really weird. I'm not complaining, though, because obviously it's money in the bank. Uh, right, next month, then. I mean, it's dropping down again, the monthly figures. We made 9,000, so... That was a nice little surprise that I didn't even notice, guys. Did not even notice right now. So, we're doing that marketing Photoshop right now, which will release very, very soon. A uh, load of bugs are now out. We'll do one more month of bug bashing. And then we'll get ready to get rid of this uh, Photoshop into the worldwide system. And everybody can buy it. Everybody, I tell you. Everybody. Right, let's uh, release this then. So press release is out there. And let's now play mode. So let's now release it. So yes, I want to release it. Uh, marketing budget will do 20,000. I'm feeling fruity. And then, yep, we'll get some copies as well. So I'm going to buy 100,000 copies. There we go. Fast forward them. Get all that done. And then these guys are now just pretty much sitting around waiting. Uh, waiting. So we'll, we'll give them that little bit of free time that they can just chill out, relax. And off they go. And then once they've gone home, are you ready to find out how much freaking Photoshop is now going to make us? Bam! We've just turned around and made 659,000 in profit. That's good. So we'll go for over 400,000 of that as profit. Not bad. That should slowly keep ramping up as time goes on. So it gets the support done, the marketing all done. These guys are like ready and raring to go for the next piece of software. So what have they said about it then in the, in the review then? So overall, the effort that points Photoshop really shows. It's probably not going to uh, move many copies. How dare you? How dare you right now? We sold 9,000 copies, which is good. 
that's really good and we're working towards you know trying to turn a profit on the whole thing as an overall now in terms of all software out there which is it this one here let's filter it by uh, let me move this over let's filter it by the type 2d editor there's 20 out there right now um so active so these are the people active here's our one in third place quality outstanding see what happens if you put a little bit of time love and all that kind of jazz into it so i feel like we can get the full 99 dollars asking price which is pretty sweet that's pretty sweet mate okay let's see what another month brings us so they're, they're, they're just pretty much chilling every time a bug comes in they all fix it Oh my, okay, we'll accept it because they've done such a good job. We've just now made even more money. One million, look, 1.6 million sales. One million dollars profit on that month alone. Who are you? Our releases, so in the past month. Oh, wait, Folio has started to pick up. Now, is that because Folio is also being used, well, we use Photoshop on that operating system. And you don't think people are going, oh, wow. You know, they're buying Photoshop and thinking, oh, wow, this is a really good thing. I wonder what their operating system's like. And they're buying that as well. Maybe. But here's all the software. So active users. So we pretty much this is our rival we're working with. The, the, pre, uh, the Picture Premium 8. Look how many active users they've got. Now, we should slowly creep up. They did release that the year before us. But we should slowly creep up and... Um, do you know what? Let me... Um, find the owner That's punch limited is the owner right now should we uh should we buy some stocks off them how do i buy stocks again i forgot how we buy stocks Here's stocks here. Um, company, full sell. Um, I don't want to sell any shares. We're not publicly listed. I don't think anyone's publicly listed at the minute, are they? No, I don't think so. I, have they changed the way that you normally buy stocks and shares? I think they might have might have done that. But um, let me uh, let me just see what the next month brings us anyway. Because we can play around, we can sit along. I just want to see if it, if it is going in the trajectory where it's then starting to ramp up quite a bit. So we'll wait to see what this moment. We're going to be entering the year 1989. We're still in the past. But, bam. So, okay, not quite as much. But let me see uh, all software again. I mean, I'm still taking chunks out of that premium picture. Eight. Picture premium, sorry. Uh, market share. Look how much profit they've made. This could be a, this could be on the long run, this one. But then again, it is number eight, so they have built up a loyal fan base when it comes to 2D editors. So maybe I can't... I mean, if I, I can't compete with them in that sense, but if I'm, like, number two to them, that's still good. That's still pretty good. So next episode, then, guys, we'll look towards doing some more expansions and setting up a couple of extra offices. It'd be nice to get a dedicated uh, support, marketing, and eventually artist team. And we'll also expand the core team as well and get uh, and the actual design team to get some more employees in there so we can get stuff done a whole lot quicker. We just got to make sure that when we are hiring, that we are pretty much doing the amazing compatibility. But guys, we are going to end it for today anyway. If you did enjoy this episode, guys, please make sure you smash that like button down below. And until next time, I'll see you all soon. So... Good. Bye.